Good morning, Bubbly Bears. It's Mrs. Brown, your bubbly teacher again. Also during this week, you're going to be working on two reading stories. I hate that we can't get in here and get our in our reading groups with our hands on, but this is going to work just as well, okay? The first story you're going to be reading looks like this. Let's talk about what we see. What do you see? Yeah, that picture right there, reading comprehension, just means that the kid is ready to read. Comprehension means understanding what we read. But that little girl is holding a what? A teddy bear, one of my favorite things to have. So this story is about a little girl named Olivia. So let's take a look. Let's dive in and see what this story is about. Remember your pointer finger. Olivia is my friend. She has a teddy bear. Her dad gave it to her. She loves her teddy bear. Remember when we read, we read like we talk. I don't want us to read like a robot. So you can see how I picked up the pace as I moved my fingers and I want you to be able to do those same things, okay? All right, so let's zoom in and look at it again. Olivia is my friend. She has a teddy bear. Her dad gave it to her. She loves her teddy bear. So if we were to talk about the story, who's the character in the story? It's talking about a little girl named what? Olivia. Remember the character tell us who the story about. Who's, who's the story about? The setting, she could be outside, she could be in her yard, she could be anywhere. We don't really know that based on what we see and the um, short story that we have in front of us. But we do know what she loves. What does she love? A teddy bear. Good job. So look at question number one. Olivia is... Hmm, my teacher, my friend, my neighbor. Olivia is who, boys and girls? You go back and find it. Olivia is my friend. You circle the B, and there you see Olivia is my friend, and you underline that. She has, does she have a teddy bear for A? Teddy bears, B, or dolls? What does she have? A teddy bear. Didn't tell us she had more than one. We only see one in that picture. And her mm gave it to her. Did her aunt give it to her for A, B, her mom, or C, her dad? Her who? Her dad. And you can see that her dad gave it to her. When you finish with this story, remember, it's going to look like this. And I'm going to model for you. I want you to see. Okay. Her, her name is Olivia. Okay. She has a what? A teddy bear. That's right. And who gave her the teddy bear, boys and girls? Her who? Her dad. So when you finish with the story, you're going to go back and read it. And then you're going to answer those questions like I did right there and show where you found the answer. Number one was right there. Live with my friend, you write that on the line and you do it with quality. Okay, great job. So now we have one more story that we're going to read. Take a look. This one is a little different, not quite as long, but you're going to have to do more writing here. Okay, you see a, that's actually a bear. 